this old guy DIY video has to do with replacing a failed seat belt stop on a friend's vehicle. So this is the passenger side. You can see the seat belt stop button is here. When this little seat belt hasp comes down, it stops and sits there. The other side has it missing. So the technique I'm going to use is just to take a button. I've got a little needle and thread laying here. And I'm going to go on the other side and just sew a button to the back of this belt. And that'll work just like the factory version, no cost. Now I'm on the side that needs the work. You can see the belt falls all the way down. So this thing just slides wherever. So it looks like the old one was right there. I'm just going to sew the button on. Here we are two minutes later. The belt stops where it's supposed to. Got a button on the back. You can see a little bit of sewing on the front. That's it. Two minutes, maybe 12 cents. Problem solved. Hope this idea helps you. Have a great day.